Hey, what's up everybody? Today I am going to crack open a PSA case. All right, welcome back to my channel everybody. If you have not subscribed yet, uh, please hit that subscribe button so that way you can see all of the uh, videos as I'm doing these, as I'm going through my childhood collection and sending a lot of cards in. Today I'm gonna to do something a little bit different. I am going to crack open a PSA case uh, from one of the cards that I had returned uh, a few months ago. Now, most of you who are watching this are probably watching because you need to open a case, but you also might be somebody who is wondering why you would crack open a case. Well, the obvious reason is if you're not happy with your grade, crack it open and resubmit it. So that is what I'm gonna do because when I sent my first order into PSA last year, I got one card back which I knew was going to have this stain qualifier up here. The ST is for a stain because on the back there is a wax stain. I learned after I submitted these how to get the, the wax off and I did a whole video which I'll put a link at the end. If you have any of these old vintage cards with wax, I found the technique to get these off. So make sure you watch that video. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna crack this open and then I'm going to get the wax off and I'm gonna resubmit it. Uh, so this is actually my first time doing it, but I've seen some different techniques. I'm gonna show the technique I'm gonna use. Uh, the reason I'm going to do it this way is because for one, I'm gonna use uh, just a pair of pliers. These are um, really durable, but most people probably have pliers. I'm also gonna use this really skinny screwdriver and that's all I'm gonna use. Now, I've also seen people use this and the reason I have this is because in my spare time I also do stained glass work. I make some uh, different projects, windows and ornaments and stuff like that. And I happen to have one of these for cracking glass and breaking glass. Uh, but I know not everybody's gonna have one of these and not everybody's gonna rush out to buy one. So uh, I'm gonna just do it with these and uh, that's pretty much all I'm gonna need as far as I am concerned. But let's crack this open and see how easy it is. All right, here we go. So, see I got these pliers, nice sharp, sharp edge for uh, cutting wire and anything. Uh, but I'm gonna start in the corner here. That popped right off. I'm gonna try to just break it a little bit more around that corner. I'm trying to get it to where I can see the opening where the label is. I'm not, not quite there yet. Let me see what, now that I kind of understand it, let me try this side. Up, oh, yeah, that came right off. Still not quite open enough yet. I can definitely see how, you just work your way, but you know, if I would have started further in a little bit, it would have been easier. But either way, I'll, I'll work it a little bit more here. There, now you can see the label sticking out. I've got an opening. I'll just take my time. I definitely don't want to run the card. Oops, sorry, there goes my camera. What I was saying, I just definitely don't want to ruin the card in any way but you can see now I'm I've got it in there so I'll just start slowly kind of working it up and down just trying to be a little more gentle so I don't knock the camera over but I can see it's starting to work up right there it's starting to come up a little bit so everything on the top is pretty much it's cracked open now so I'm just gonna work it with my hands at this point 
I can feel it coming, so I want to be kind of easy with it, but there it is. All right, so it cracked, it cracked right there along the uh, front of the card, but it did not damage the card at all. It was just laying right there. So look at that. I got it. Um, card's fine. I definitely, you know, now that I know what I'm doing, uh, I, I could do it a lot quicker and a lot easier. So not too bad. All right, well, there you go. Um, wasn't the cleanest break, but do you think I care what this looks like now? I don't. Um, one of the other reasons why I even did this is because I want to, I wanted to do it as somebody who hadn't done it before to show people if they're if they're worried about doing it. It really wasn't it wasn't difficult. Um, definitely, I if I ever do this again, uh, I would go in a little bit further at the beginning. It didn't didn't matter. I just did a couple extra clips clips to get it. Uh, you just have to get it to where the label is sticking out so you can see where the little hole will open up basically and at that point just put the uh, screwdriver in there um, I thought it was going to break a little cleaner coming back and not have this but it didn't damage the card at all you know that was the main thing obviously you just don't want to damage the card uh, but the card looks fine so I'm happy about that I'm going to clean off this wax and I'm going to get ready to send this in on my next order so please uh, check out that video if you have any kind of a wax issue but that's it for now guys Pretty easy. Thanks. Talk to you later.